Just four seasons ago, Ryan Villapoto began his Supercross career with an uneven effort, which saw him miss four rounds and finish sixth in the points. He ended 2009 winning two of the last three races, giving fans a sign of things to come. In 2010, Villapoto made a run at the title. He battled with eventual champ Ryan Dungey for much of the campaign and sat second in the standings when he suffered a season-ending injury at round 14 in St. Louis. Questions about how he would bounce back in 2011 dominated the preseason talk. He answered his critics with a win at the opener in Anaheim. Villapoto would go on to capture five more victories and earn his first Supercross championship. It would be the beginning of one of the greatest years in racing history, culminating with a million dollar payday at the inaugural Monster Energy Cup. In 2012, the Kawasaki star picked up right where he left off. He has dominated the season, winning eight of 13 races. Villapoto clinched the title in Houston with four rounds to go and became just the fifth rider in history to win back-to-back -back Supercross titles. After just four short years, Ryan Villapoto's accomplishments put him among the sport's all-time greats. And at just 23 years old, his spot in Supercross history is secure. Each year I, I set a goal and the goal is to, to win championships and if I can do that then then I meet my goals for that year and, and after the after the year is over we'll you know reevaluate and, and set new ones.